X, the holiday season continues as the temperatures drop and it begins to feel more like Christmas. And with that comes a lot of fun events in our area. This week, the Nancy Carson Library is presenting Pork Chop Productions, Holly and the Christmas Kerfuffle. Here to talk about this is librarian Renee Burton and head of reference Adam Burton from the Nancy Carson Library. Thank you both for joining us. Thank Thanks you for having us. us. Um, exciting time right now. Kids are getting ready to be out of school. So the library has a really interesting production set for them this week. What can we expect? Um, well, Pork Chop Productions is a team out of Aiken. Um, they are so much fun. They're hilarious. They put together these plays. We have them at the library every summer. Um, I have not seen a Christmas program from them yet, so I'm looking forward to, to catching that myself on Thursday. Um, they use a lot of masks, and um, it's funny the kids think that it's a bigger team than they are. It's usually just two ladies, oh. and the kids will be like, where was that other person? That, cause, because of the masks that they use. It's always <laughs> so much fun. So. And they throw a lot of like pop culture references in and yes. the jokes they do th as the story progresses. So the whole family just gets sucked right into it. This is really neat, just in time for the holidays. But this isn't the only event that the library puts together throughout the year. There's so many events for families. Talk to us about some of those other ones. Um, well, we have a regular story time um, that'll be starting back up in January. We usually take a break um, around Christmas time. Families are all busy, um, but we'll start. That's on Fridays. Um, we do two different ones for uh, ages zero to two, and then for three, um, three and up, and. Um, then uh, we have our big time, of course, is summer. We always have uh, weekly events during the summer. Um, we have, uh, we do during spring break, we'll have spring break movie week where we show movies every day. Um, people can bring their own snacks and just come and enjoy a, a free kids movie with us. Really neat. And I think the important part is that kids and families are getting used to the library. So Adam, speak to us about just the importance of getting families and kids in those doors. Oh, it's just, it's such a fundamental thing. I mean, just the idea of, well, you know, giving, maybe giving the screens a rest, you know, uh, getting them to enjoy uh, the act of reading. I, my mother taught me to read when I was three years old, so it's, it's, I can't even think of a time when I didn't have it. So as early as we can get the kids interested, the better, I think, you know, read everything. It doesn't matter what it is, you know, people will say, well, you shouldn't read this, this is trash. There's no trash. Just read it. You'll figure out what's good and what, what holds up and what doesn't. And this play happens this Thursday. This is in time for the holiday season. Tell us, what do you want families and kids to walk away with? I hope they walk away with that the library can be a fun place. So many people think that the library is just as serious. You have to be quiet. Um, it's, you know, but it can be a fun place. Um, and you can come in and enjoy a play and then you can check out books or movies or, you know, whatever we have to offer. And, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a good place to be. <laughs> and where can people go for more information if they're interested in going to the event on Thursday or just in general to learn about the library? You can go to our Facebook page. Um, I keep that updated and we also have Instagram as well. Um, we have our website, at, uh, the ABBE website, too. We keep that updated as well, but mainly Facebook and Instagram. <laughs> okay, perfect. And again, this is Holly and the Christmas Kerfuffle. It happens this Thursday. Is there anything that families need to do beforehand or bring? Nope, just show up on Thursday. That's it. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you both so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. Thank, thank you. you for having us.